What is going on, guys? Real Touch Gmail here, and today I have the final Game Maker Contest uh, results video. And I just like to say that I got about 15 entries for this contest, and uh, I narrowed it down to about 10. Uh, not about, it actually is 10. So uh, if your game is not seen in here, then your game sucked, or uh, I just didn't get it, which probably is not the case. So. Uh, we got our first place prize, which is the free Game Maker Studio, uh, uh, free copy of Game Maker Studio. So um, let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so what I liked about this game is that it reminded me a lot of a game called I Made a Game with Zombies in it, and I love that game. Uh, I also like the cannon that you can shoot out of the gun. That's pretty cool. Uh, I also do like the elapsed time up top, and you do have ammo and a bomb limit. Some things I don't like though is I don't know why there's white coming out of the blood uh, and the grass texture is a little weird and it doesn't really get any harder so those are some things to work on. Uh, I don't know. Fair game. Fair game. Alright so what I like about this game is that it was very simple and that you just followed around your guy with your cursor. Uh, and very smooth movement I will say. It's very nice and it has a nice pace. Uh, throughout the game and uh, you know you actually see some new stuff as you get further on some things I didn't like about the game was that uh, you had the default block going around it and I didn't really like how it cuts off the uh, the blocks like at the top there and it shows the score other than that it was a pretty nice game alright so what struck me in this game here is that it was a platforming game and a platforming survival game and you don't really see that too much but uh... i don't know i i liked it the movement was nice and crisp uh, i liked the atmosphere around it and uh... you know it was pretty cool the different things that would drop down on you such as arrows monsters boxes stuff like that some things you need to work on though you definitely need to add sound to the game there was absolutely no sound in the game and the mechanics need to be adjusted a little bit because it was a little bit glitchy at times like uh, getting trapped under arrows or um, in in rocks, stuff like that. So just go ahead and work on that, and uh, you should have a pretty nice game. All right, so this game was pretty well made. Uh, it's called Eliminator, and it's a very old school type of uh, shooter survival game that you would find in like an arcade, reminding me of Asteroids. Uh, now your play is this guy. He's in the middle here, and you can set down turrets and uh, s defend yourself and survive. Uh, pretty nice effects in here, and as you go along, you do get more stuff on the way. As long with this override um, little mode here, which is pretty awesome. Some things I didn't like about it though was that uh, you need more you need more sounds. I mean, all there was was music in the background and uh, I don't know and some of the movement could be um, could be done a lot better so and not a lot better just you know need to work on the movement just a little bit and the game progresses really well so in all it was a good game alright so this game was in Dutch um, to start off with and this game was um, pretty uh i don't know it was different you uh, it was very glitchy uh, i mean i like the concept uh where you can walk around and you got um, it's basically survival you do stuff during the day and then at night time uh, the monsters come out and you have to survive uh but let me just tell you right now the monsters were not the smartest <laughs> Alright, so I don't even know if this game qualifies, but it is a Minecraft little remake engine. And basically all you do is break the blocks and pick them up. <laughs> uh, that's pretty much all I saw. The world is not randomly generated. Uh, it's like that the whole time. That clicking is what you hear when you actually click. But uh, it's not even really survival. There's nothing that can uh, attack you or anything. So, uh, very bare bones. Alright, so what I saw from this game was that it was an actual Minecraft remake. And uh, basically every single thing uh, in Minecraft you can do in this uh, little Minecraft 2D uh, world here. So uh, here's your uh, guy, you know, there's rain, there's elements. Uh, from playing it, there were mob spawners, there was the nether you could go to. 
um, all these caves that you can explore and everything like that um, is in this game. So the props to this guy. This is a fantastic game. Uh, and the crafting as well is pretty nice. Uh, thumbs up by me. Okay, now in my opinion, the concept for this game was just really really awesome um, you had to you have this guy and you have to shoot a bullet and actually steer the bullet uh, avoiding the walls into like in a purple orb uh, so now some things you could have done was you know make particle effects for the bullet I don't know uh, put some more sounds in there maybe move the player around a little bit but uh, in all it was pretty cool um, I had fun playing it Alright, so this game's name is Kanitso, um, and it's basically a survival game where it's pretty cool, you get to pick your player, and you just jump on these little ladybug things uh, and survive, and it's pretty cool. Uh, nice particle effect, and nice background, um, I'm not sure what that is, oh, clouds, okay. <laughs> um, you know, it's pretty cool, uh, I'm not sure why it's, oh, again, because of the clouds, alright, that's why it's raining. <laughs> um, but no, it's uh, it's pretty cool. The only thing I can suggest is to get a couple more sounds in there and uh, get some better progression uh, because that's really all I saw. But nice game. All right. So what I liked about this game was that uh, it was pretty cool in the fact that you can create your own guy and uh, go through these dungeons or rooms um, by yourself or with four other people, which is pretty cool. Uh, so here you have your guy and you can go through this chest, pick stuff up, and you attack and it's basically strategy on how to kill these guys here. So uh, I don't know, it's, it's pretty cool, pretty cool concept. Um, you should probably work on the graphics a little bit and uh, I don't know, the sounds are pretty good. So uh... Alright, so coming up in third place we have drumroll please. We have Follow the Dots, and that is going to be our third place entry here. And go ahead and message me for a Game Maker tutorial, and I will go ahead and do it for you. Um, if not, that's cool, that's cool. Uh, but yeah, congratulations for third place. Uh, pretty cool game. I picked it, you know, just for the smoothness, and uh, you could play it over and over again. So, pretty awesome game. Best of luck to you in the future. Alright, so coming in second place for that beautiful silver medal, we have the one, the only, Minecraft 2D. Uh, now this, I picked for second place, uh, and not first place because it wasn't original at all, but everything is just very, very well done. Uh, completely made in Game Maker 2, which was uh, pretty surprising because it is uh, pretty well made. And I'm not saying that, you know, Game Maker... Uh, is a bad program or anything it's just uh, wow it's pretty awesome uh, I like the lighting everything in it is pretty cool uh, thumbs up by me alright now this is where it all comes down to the first place gold medal that will be receiving a free copy of Game Maker Studio uh, very exciting to say that I picked this game because of the feel of it, I liked, I don't know, I just liked the feel of it, I liked the look of it, I liked um, that it, it was original in its own ways, and um, I don't know, it's just, it's, it's a good game, and that is of course why I picked it, and that is going to be, let me hit that drum roll please, and we will be saying that it is... <laughs> Eliminator by, uh, I'm pretty sure that is the Nerdage Official. Um, I might be wrong there, but, uh, I'm, I don't know. It, it was the Eliminator. Uh, you're looking at it right now. It's pretty, uh, sick in my eyes. I liked it. Uh, I don't know. It was pretty awesome. That's, of course, why I picked it. I said that like 500 times, but, uh, yeah. You will be receiving a free copy of 
the Game Maker Studio and go ahead and or I will message you with the serial code and uh, boom there we are so uh, thank you all for joining the contest uh, hope for uh, I, ho I hope to be doing another one in the near future uh, with another awesome prize but uh, for now thank you all for joining uh, it's been really cool reviewing everyone's game and everyone that did not make uh, third, second, or first. There was some pretty tough um, competition here, so just next time, make it better. You just learn as you go on. So uh, again, thank you all for uh, joining and participating. Uh, go ahead and leave a thumbs up if you like this video um, or if you saw your game. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Go ahead and leave a like, go and subscribe. I will see you sexy legends in my next video. Peace.